So hey guys, so installing yeah, installing the backup camera. So basically, GM suggests that you should route it to the top so it doesn't get damaged from road grime and road stuff and everything. And they give you a bunch of these little sticky uh, sticky things that you just clean the roof with alcohol and then you pass a tie wrap through it and it goes pretty good. And you can put them every foot, every two feet. I got 24 of them, so I'm gonna route it as better as best as I can. The camera comes with two-way tape if you don't want to drill a hole through your roof. That's why I decided to go through the roof. So that way there you can just stick the two-way tape and stick the camera and then angle it at a 35 degree angle. And we're running the just a line as you can see him running it a little bit off the side. I wasn't sure if I should run it close to the side or, but anyways, that's something I can always buy later and uh, do it over again and it doesn't really matter. But uh, we're trying to hurry up and almost forgot to film this thing because uh, black flies are out and we're in shorts and uh, getting my eggs and they keep them alive. So trying to wipe this with alcohol as much as we can and get a good stick run it down hopefully it looks happy like you well you can't see the wire from the roof so we're just on the deck so anyways i got my son helping me out there he might grab the camera so i told him that we're almost done matt and we won't have no flat no black no more black flies this is, uh, this is how basically it's working. You just pull it tight and then put a tie wrap here. That's the camera. And then a pair of cutters. Here, Matt, got this. All right, so working my way down. Maybe they're starting to run out. Alcohol away. Rubbing alcohol, that is. Oh, like black flies. So, anyway. <sighs> so, I got. Put all these on soon, just in case I need some extra. Yeah, there's a lot of access wire, I can tell you that much. Too much access wire. Okay. Howdy. What, babe? My like that yeah, I'll be going to test it out soon. Be going to test it out soon. Okay. Okay. Can't wait to see what it's going to do in the back. It's going to be pretty sharp. There we go, cut those off. Hey, black flies are crazy. There we go. There we go. There we go. So you can't go anywhere. There's a bar across the bottom. There's three straps. Left a little bit of loose here so it doesn't bang in the front here. So we ran some tie wraps all the way up on the side. I don't know if you can look at that one. Yeah, so that's holy shit trying to hurt it. So basically, yeah, so we gave it a little bit of slack here. So wrapped it around here. So if I need a little bit of slack, I can take it. So there we go. We're plugged in. It says you have to plug it in before you turn the truck on or it won't work. And the seven-way plug has to be plugged in. 
or it won't work. I guess they do it for safety to make sure the trailer's connected before you take off. So we got a few of these extra left. So anywhere where I see that it wants to maybe rattle, I might throw an extra one, extra one, extra one, so it doesn't rub through my paint. But now we're getting eaten by the bugs alive and we want to go test it out and show you guys. So we'll be right back, clean up our mess and jump in the truck and uh, the pickup and then go. And we'll, just, we'll bring you guys along to see what the camera looks like. And if we have to adjust, it has to be on a 35 angle. So I think I put it at 35 angle. Maybe we'll have to redo it, but we'll see you in a second. All right, guys, let's go try this out. I think we got to calibrate it. So turn the pickup on. Let's see what's going to happen. So shockwave 18 footer. Let's go with that. And now we got towing assistance already. Okay. Camera. There you go. There you just saw it. Okay, that makes the camera. This that's that makes the back drive of the trailer. To calibrate. Oh, drive forward to calibrate. There we go. So we'll do that. Usually. Oh, it's calibrate. You can see it underneath. Yeah. The yellow bar. So you can see the yellow bar at the bottom of the screen. You know, keep driving forward. Yeah, but I'm gonna run out of driveway. So I'm just gonna go around the block, I guess, and keep going. Hopefully it works. Hopefully it recognizes that what we're doing. Oh, it stopped calibrating. Maybe I gotta drive straight. That's cool how you turn when it sees everything on the side, the cameras and the mirrors. You know, but you don't need to, no longer need a camera, or I mean like tow mirrors at all. Oh yeah, it keeps calibrating, okay, so. Around. Well, this is gonna be nice. Like, no need for tow mirrors. Watch what I'm gonna turn. Look at that big screen, and everything. You can see your whole corner. Also shows uh, red on the sides. If you're close to something, it'll show you where you're gonna turn. If you're gonna turn sharp, it warns you. So, but I didn't think it would take that long to calibrate. But uh, yeah. Every time I turn a corner, pretty good, eh, babe? Yeah. Pretty nice, eh? Like, as if you could see the whole side of your, like, that's pretty amazing. All right, so, I think I might hit the highway. It's gonna calibrate faster, I think. See, look, put the flasher on. It shows you the red spot where it is dangerous for a zone for somebody was there or whatever, that possibility, but, uh, almost calibrated. The line's right here now. Oh, you see? Red on the side. That's that gets uh, soon start turning. You see everything? Oh, what was that noise? Calibrate? Calibrate. Yeah. Okay. I want this one full size. Is it possible? And then camera in the box of the pickup truck. You can see that. Trailer. Trailer. Trailer here. I don't know what these ones do. There you go. That's the back of the trailer. That's everything you see in the back. So, everything, like, if you look at it that way, you can see exactly what's behind you at all times. So, all right. I just wanted to take you guys along for the ride. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you watching. Hopefully this helps if somebody's planning on putting a camera back there and to see what the vision looks like. It looks like pretty awesome to me. It makes everything simple. It gives you everything you want to see. I, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And we'll catch you on the next one. You guys be safe. Bye for now. Have yourself a good weekend.